In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can send an auto-reply text message that you're driving on your iPhone 11 or the 11 Pro or the Pro Max. Now first, let's go back to your home screen by swiping up and then tap on the settings icon. In settings, you want to tap on do not disturb and then go down. Now when your car or when your phone, sorry, when your phone is in do not disturb while driving mode, and if someone sends you a text message, here's how you can set up your phone to auto reply. So if you tap on auto reply to, there are four options. No one, reasons, favorites, and all contacts. So all contacts is that everyone in your contacts, um, the phone will automatically reply to them. If it's in favorites, so if the person who sent you a text message is in the favorites group, then the phone will automatically auto reply. Otherwise, it will not. The in reasons, so the reason option is anyone has recently in, been in contact with you on the phone for the last two days. So that is the key for the last two days only. Then the phone will automatically uh, send out a auto reply text message when you are in driving mode. So you can choose one of the options. Next, if we go back here, you can see there is an auto reply message. Now this is the default text message. If you don't like the default text message, you can uh, create your own custom text message by simply deleting that and then putting your own text message down here. And so that's how you can set your phone to auto uh, replied to a text message when you are driving. And how do you set your phone to automatically uh, enable do not disturb while driving? So you can tap on activate here. And there are a few options you could choose automatically. So when, you're f when the phone detects that you are in motion, that you are in the car moving uh, forwards, it will uh, basically automatically uh, activate do not disturb while driving. Or you could set when you are connected to a car Bluetooth. Or you can use... Um, CarPlay right here. You can turn that with activate with CarPlay, and that's it. Uh, finally, you can swipe up to go back to your home screen. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.